Hey tech enthusiasts, welcome back to Fast Cabling. In today's video, we are diving deep into something that's not only exciting, but crucial for those looking to upgrade their network infrastructures. So in this step-by-step -step guide, we'll be installing 2.5G network devices and integrating them with 10G fiber connectivity. And if you're ready to supercharge your network for lower latency, increase reliability and seamless real-time applications then stay tuned because you won't want to miss it and if you have any questions about your tech projects feel free to contact us through the link down in the description box below since our team of experts is offering free tech consultation for your specific need as we all know, the demand for faster, more reliable networks is growing every day. Whether you're running multiple smart home devices, high-performance workstations, or gaming setup, your network must keep up. And that's where upgrading to 10G fiber optics becomes a game changer. By connecting 2.5G network devices to a 10G fiber backbone, you will experience a dramatic reduction in latency and making real-time applications like gaming and video calls smoother and you will boost overall reliability for those heavy data loads such as large file transfer or streaming multiple high definition feeds. So it's a serious upgrade for anyone who wants uninterrupted high-speed performance. And next, we'll be using our 10G fiber media conversion kits to make this upgrade possible. Now, these kits include everything you need to get up and running quickly and efficiently. Let's check out what we have here. Now inside the kits, we have a pair of the 10G media converter. Now this converter has four 2.5 gigabit per second Ethernet port and two 10G SFP plus slot. And this device or the backbone of your setup, they will be bridging the gap between your 2.5G network devices and the 10G fiber connection. And we also have a pair of the 10G BD SFP Plus module. Now this small but powerful components allow bi-directional communication over a single fiber string, making your setup more efficient. It also includes a pre-made 100 meters fiber optic cable. And if you need a longer reach, we've got options of 100, 300, and even up to 500 meters. And now let's talk about the key features that make this kit so powerful. First up, we have the four 2.5 gigabit per second RJ45 Ethernet port and the two 10G SFP Plus slot on the media converter. Now this gives you the flexibility to connect up to four 2.5G devices, such as wireless SS point or gaming computers, and while still leveraging the 10G fiber backbone for super fast data transfer. And another awesome feature is the web smart management. Now this makes the setup and control super easy. No need to be a network expert. And we'll walk through that in a bit later. And one of the biggest advantages of this kit is how quick and reliable the installation is, thanks to the pre-made fiber optic cables. So you don't need a skilled technician to cut or terminate the fiber optic cables. So everything is ready to go, so you can avoid downtime and enjoy uninterrupted service. So next, let's get into the actual setup. So now we're in front of the demonstration board. The first thing to consider is optimal placement. You should choose the best locations for your media converters, preferably where they can easily connect to your 2.5G devices and your fiber network. So let's begin. Now, once you place your media converter, it's time to start connecting devices. Simply plug in your 2.5G devices like our computer and also our router into the RJ45 port on the media converter. And now comes the fiber connection part. This is where we start the 10G magic. First, we'll insert the 10G BD SFP Plus module into the media converters. And then connect them 
using our pre-made two-string fiber optic cable that came with the kit. Now, whether you're using the 100 meters, 300 meters, or 500 meters option, it's as simple as plug and play. And since we have two string, so let's choose string A. Plug it in into our SFP module. So this side, we are done. Let's come over to the other side. We're going to do the same thing. Insert our SFP plus module. Remember, we use string A. So by using the pre-made fiber optic cable, we don't have to worry about the connector. And then plug in the Ethernet cable to our RJ45 port that connected to our Wi-Fi 6 SS point. So our whole connection is done. And one of the coolest things about this setup is how future-proof it is. You're not just limited to 2.5G devices. The media converters are compatible with 10G, 5G, 2.5G, and 1G networks. So as your network grows and you add more advanced equipment, you are already prepared because this setup can handle it all. And let's take a moment to appreciate the pre-terminated fiber optic cable that come with the kits because this means no special skills are required to set it up. There's no need for terminating cables on sites. It's quick, reliable, and saves your time, money, and headache. Trust me, this salon makes a world of difference when you're doing a network upgrade like this. So now let's take a brief walkthrough of the web smart management interface. So from here, you can monitor and manage your entire network setup easily. If you want to check on the port status or adjust network setting, it's all right here at your fingertips, making the whole system super user-friendly, even for those who aren't network pros. We also have VLAN to segregate network and also QoS to prioritize your network. And here we have the MAC address, security, monitoring, and also firmware update. So there you have it, a complete guide to installing 2.5G network devices with 10G fiber connectivity. So by upgrading your network with this 10G fiber media converter kit, you're setting yourself up for lower latency, greater reliability, and future-proof flexibility. And whether you're a gamer, running a home office, or simply want to push your network to the next level, this upgrade is the perfect solution. And thank you very much for joining us at Fast Cabling. If you have any questions, feel free to drop them down in the comment section below. And I'll see you in our next video.